Does your dog keep you up at night with her itching and scratching? It could be a sign that she has food allergies. I'm Vanessa from Dogs Naturally, and today I want to give you five warning signs that your dog may have food allergies. Before we get started, make sure you subscribe to this channel, and if you're on YouTube, click the alert notification. Itching, recurring ear infections, and non-stop scratching at her ears, paws, and face are all signs that your dog might have a problem with allergies. Allergies are an immune response where your dog responds to a trigger, often something in her food or environment. If that trigger is food, you'll want to get to the bottom of what exactly is causing the problem so you don't keep triggering the allergy. Common food allergies for dogs often include corn, chicken or eggs, or even starches like potatoes and lentils. So let's go over the five signs to watch out for when it comes to food allergies. First is chronic ear infections. If your dog gets more than two or three ear infections a year, it's a likely sign that she has a food allergy. Ear infections are stinky, yeasty, and have black or brown buildup, and usually come with persistent head shaking. Number two is red, brown, or bronzed nail beds. This is by far one of the easiest symptoms to pick out when it comes to food allergies. The base of your dog's nail beds may be red or even bloody looking. This is a warning sign of an inflammatory immune response. Number three is bronzing around the lips. If you see this on your dog, it can indicate a yeast infection, often triggered by an allergy, but make sure you rule out a sunburn first. Number four is itchy skin, red underbelly, and dull coat. When these symptoms are seen together, it can be a sign of an allergy. You might see skin that is red or pink, dry and inflamed, and it's likely that baths or over-the-counter medications won't help. And lastly, number five, watery eyes. Just like in people, watery eyes can mean your dog's allergic to something. Dogs with watery eyes are also often scratching at them, and that causes extra tear production that can bring on staining and irritation. So, if your dog has one, or more, of the symptoms I talked about, you might be wondering what the next step for you is. The first thing to do is look at your dog's diet. If your dog is eating a processed kibble, it might be time to look at a home-cooked or fresh raw diet. You want to reduce the amount of additives, grains, and artificial components in her bowl because these are things that often trigger allergies. But keep in mind, going raw or homemade doesn't guarantee allergy-free. So if you find out that your dog's allergic to any specific ingredient, you'll want to make sure no matter what you feed that you leave that ingredient out. And remember, it can take time to rule out food allergies and help your dog's body recover from the damage done. So be patient, especially if your dog's allergies have been going on a long time. If you found this video helpful, feel free to like and subscribe to our channel. And don't forget, you can visit dogsnaturallymagazine.com for more helpful tips anytime. Thanks for watching.